Hello everyone, today we're going to be looking at the Kroger Dollar General Exclusives. These are the newest ones. So yeah, we got the 70 Va Volkswagen Baja Bug, Big Big Air Bel Air, kind of confusing names, Pro Stock Camaro, and my favorite, the Jeep Gladiator. And over here we've got the Honda Prelude, 67 Camaro, GTR R35, and Erkenstein Rod in a very nice purple. So yeah. Let's open it all up. Uh, I personally like the Dollar General exclusives better, so we're going to start with the Kroger. Correct me if I'm wrong on the store names. Um, but yeah. First is the 1970 Volkswagen Baja Bug. In black. Pretty cool. I don't collect the tune castings this much, that much, but these were given to me, so I figured I'd just open them up. And yeah. This one's pretty cool, actually. I kind of like the way that it sits and the big rear tires and, the, like, the big engine. I really like the engine in the back. The yellow wheels go surprisingly well with the black. It's got the cool, like, Baja racing stripes on the top. Very, quite cool. I don't know. For fantasy casting, it's pretty nice. And then next is the Big Air Bel Air. Never actually bought any of these, um, but I really like the blue color on this one. So, yeah. I think this is kind of, I don't have a normal one, but I do have a lowered one. A bit, a uh, knockoff, not knockoff, but like redesign almost of the normal Bel Air Gasser for kind of to be Baja. Um, yeah. I don't know if it's supposed to have windows or if mine's just effective, but I'm going to assume it's not supposed to have windows because it's, yeah. Um, otherwise, I have a defective one, which is kind of cool, but like the gold wheels on this one with the gold interior, kind of yellowish gold though, and the, the BF Goodrich, Goodrich Hot Wheels. Baja Blazers stuff on here. Looks super cool. Really clean paint job. Gold stripes. Really nice. Next is the 10 Pro Stock Camaro. The Pictionary Junior. There's a chase card, I think. But this is just a normal one, so... Yeah. Pretty nice. It's got the super low-to-the-ground front. And, like, wheelie bar on the back. With all the, like... Pictionary things like there's a plane, there's a car, boat, sun, hot air balloon. That's really creative. And the so both sides are different, so it's pretty cool. I didn't think I'd like this one too much, but I actually really like it. I like the um, all the different decals on it. Super cool. I'm pretty excited about that one. That one might actually be my favorite. Next is the 2020 Jeep Gladiator in white. I don't know what the normal color of any of these are, but this one's pretty cool. With the blacked out grill and the motorcycles in the back. Um, I quite like this casting. Looks really good in the white. I like all the like detailed lines that are like all on the top and the side. Pretty good casting details on it. But yeah, let's move to the Dollar General exclusives. First is the Erkenstein Rod in purple. I bought a couple of these, but I decided I didn't need them and got rid of them. But I'm definitely keeping this one because I like the purple on it a lot. Super wide in the front. Pretty cool like roll cage look in the back. Chrome interior, engines, whatnot. Um, doesn't want to stay on though. Big wheels, very out in the open. This one's pretty cool. Very wide on the top. I don't know, this is quite the cool car. I really like this. Anyway, next is the 67 Camaro. And the worldwide optimism decals. I know there's a ton of people that collect like 
all of the 67 Camaros, but I only got a few of them. So yeah, this one's pretty cool. I really like the like teal color on here. Perpetual childhood change. I don't know, I'm sure this is a fundraiser car, but I really like the way it looks, so super cool. This one would look really good with a base swap. Next is probably one of the only castings I actually collect in this bunch. GTR R35 um, in black. I really like the way this one looks. It's, uh, I've seen a bunch of GTRs recently. I'm not sure why, but they all look really nice. This one's got the rear details and the front details on it. The red and the black look really good together. Um, yeah, super cool. I really like this one. I I really like mixing exclusives in with my like normal main lines just because they look really good together. But yeah, this one's super cool. I really like that one. Probably a lot of people's favorite is the Honda Prelude in this like I don't know what color it is. I'll post a short of it outside um, under the sun. But yeah, let's see. I'm pretty sure this thing was going for like. A ton of money when it first came out but i'm sure it's gone down by now it's probably only a couple of bucks but it's got like full details a honda symbol matte no not matte back gloss black hood full details the headlights are part of the window it says prelude on the back bumper super nice i really like the wheels on it but yeah thanks for watching see you in the next video Bye.